Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to a brand new video. If you guys miss any of the previous uploads, I'll leave the link to the playlist in the description. Also, very quickly, this is a special video. I have never before uploaded 30 videos back to back to back every single day. Well, today we broke that milestone. Daily uploads for basically an entire month. So if you guys are still enjoying the series, give a video a like. Let's shoot for, let's say, 3,000. And also, about 70% of you guys who are watching Watching my videos aren't subscribed so consider subscribing if you have been enjoying the series and with that being said let's jump right into the content all right i'm a bit tired of blast mine right now so we're just gonna collect and get 100,000 experience Awesome. So I'm pretty much the same amount away from uh, 80 mining, which I will definitely be getting in this episode. But for now, I think I'll go and do something else. We just got an imaginary level 109 fire making, pushing us just over 35 mil. So we just gained another 5 million experience there pretty much. I started the tracker a little bit late, so it's not actually... I haven't only gained 4 mil XP, I've basically gained 5 mil. Uh, but still... Um, I will probably be pushing all the way to 50 mil fine making right now, and then I think I'll be opening the crates. I am not quite sure who did the league balancing point thing, but why is 100 winter Todd kills 10 points? 10, dude, what is this, man? Right, so I'll be opening this chest probably like 10 at a time until I get the boots, so I have the full set. But uh, yeah, let's just see what do we get. I'll just open this pretty fast, I think, even though I am going to be spending a lot of time here. Unfortunately... <sighs> No pages. I definitely need pages. I mean, new seeds are good, but pages is literally what I need. And not seeing any is a bit scary. Also, those were mostly 1,000 point crates. Imaginary level 110. I don't know how what you need to do to show that on the actual thing. I know that's like a rune light thing, but we now have almost 40 mil fire making experience. I think that's gonna be enough fire making for a little bit. Let's open the crates very quickly right here. We only need boots. We did not get boots, we did not get pages either. Ah, uh, that's rough. Uh, but we are now over, I think, 41 million experience. So, very nice there. Um, but right now I'm gonna go continue fishing for a little bit. I do wanna get this agility up uh, slowly but surely, and I have to AFK for a bit. So this is what I do, right? When I, when I can't play the game, I do this, I do this, and then I do this, I teleport right here. And then I just AFK. It is so good. I'm so I'm actually genuinely happy I took Arcane Courier for my Relic. Because if I didn't, I would not have 32 million fishing XP. I hope that's enough XP for 80 mining. Oh, way more than enough. 185,000 right there. And ladies and gentlemen, we are 80 mining, which also means we are 80 base stats. And together, both of those give me 350 extra points, which basically moves us even further up the ranks. So that's awesome. Um, I can just uh, stockpile my dynamite every single day. I can claim 80 for free. And uh, maybe I get some from raids as well. And then eventually we can do this all the way to 99. I have never done this in my life. Apparently you can prune a diseased palm tree and it fixes it. What? And that's, that's actually so cool. I've never done this. Here we go, let's see what do we get, can we please get a bucket, a dragon fruit seed which is very nice and Kronos. There is one thing that bothers me slightly and that is the fact that there is only three very easy, um, you know, 10 point tasks that I still have not completed. One of them is just to enter the chasm of fire, I can literally do this in just a second. But some of the others are to steal some artifacts and that's actually the best way to train thieving and fletching at the same time. Uh, so I think that's what I'm gonna be doing next, I've tried it in the past, I wasn't the best at it i kept like failing but i'm gonna give it another shot i'll spend some of the money to buy uh the broad arrowheads maybe get the fletching to 25 mil very quickly and uh yeah but first i want to enter this tier 3 of the chasm of fire i still think this is one of the coolest places in the game i just wish it was used more often like i genuinely think that is okay that has to be the bug that is not a level 3 yet that is only level 2 and i already completed the task Pretty sure that's a bug. You're supposed to go all the way down. That's the second... What? Yeah, I don't think they playtested this too well. But anyways, 10 extra points right there. Very nice. Decided to come to the floor 3 just in case. Just spent about 3 million on 42,000 uh, broad arrowheads. And uh, we're gonna be getting some nice experience with these. Here we go, that is no longer gonna bother me, uh, we have completed 10 more artifacts, so we are at 15,410, the only 10 point task left, 
are pretty much the farming contracts one, which I will get obviously passively. But now what we want to get is, you see these still 25 artifacts, 50 artifacts, 100 artifacts. And there's also a 250 artifact task that gives you 100 points and a 500 artifact task that gives you 250 points, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. Here we go, we just got another level, um, I think. Yeah, there it is, 88 thieving, very nice. I'm not sure if I showed this, but for every artifact that I get, I actually get 35,000 experience. That is just crazy, honestly. So 89 thieving, and we're up to 17.2 million fletching experience. Very nice. I just gave in 25 artifacts, which gives us 50 league points. Here is 90 thieving, and yeah. We gave in 50 more artifacts for 50 more leak points and we now have 15,500. So if I do end up going for 50 mil fire making today, I will be getting over 16,000 points, which is really crazy to think about. And there it is, 92. A lot of people have been asking in my previous video what is going on with the AFK account and we just reached 50 million hit points experience, which means we now have 9,400 points on it. Um, if I had double XP relic, that would be very close to 100 mil and those would be at 80 mil. So if you go for the AFK account, do not go for the attack speed relic. Um, I, uh, at the moment, I regret the decision uh, of going the attack speed relic. But originally, I thought I would be PVMing on this account a lot. Unfortunately, though, um, I recently realized that I can completely normally do raids with what I have uh, and that makes it so I'm probably not gonna be raiding on the other account it really there's like no point to do it so I'm just uh, hard focusing on the main account right now gonna be pushing high points try to go for those ladders and uh uh, I'll just leave the AFK account AFKing. Maybe I'll do some um, interesting things towards the end, but uh, for now, it's just gonna sit on sand crabs, try to get to 200 mil stats, and that's pretty much it. 93 thieving. Here we go. That is going to be 94 thieving, and now we're gonna move on and do a little bit of fire making. I just need a little bit of a change of pace. We also got all the way from 13 million fletching XP to 22.2 fletch XP, which is really sick, but now let's finish off 50 million fire making so there we go with that level we ended up getting 2100 total level but I do have virtual levels enabled so that's why it shows a bit more but that is because a lot of the skills we're gonna be training past 13 million very quick five crates I just need boots another pair of gloves I'll be keeping those because if we get extras I can then trade I I'll basically start getting magic seeds instead of the gloves so we keep all of those and unfortunately no pages no boots since we are so close to 50 million fire making, as you can see, we were averaging about, what, 7 mil XP an hour, but there it is, 50 million fire making experience, we just got 500 leak points, and we now are over 16,000 points. If I quickly refresh the high scores, I'm currently rank 190, and wait, I need to hop a world real quick first, actually, so we hop a world, so we refresh the high score, um, and then we refresh the site, and now we are rank 149. We jumped 50 ranks just getting this done. And I could get 500 more points for 100 mil fire making and then 500 more points for 200 mil fire making. And that wouldn't take me too long to do anyways. However, right now we are done uh, with fire making for a little bit. We will open up all the crates that we got. So we have the crates right here. Let's see what do we get. I still only need boots and pages. And we ended up getting no pages and no boot, but a U seed is decent and I guess some okay seeds there. Now we're gonna do farm run, try to get 90 Herblore. First time ever checking a spirit tree. How much XP is that? 197,000. Holy shit. So we are getting some crazy XP per hour right now, over 5 million. But obviously we don't have enough supplies to maintain that. But there it is, 89 Herblor, one more level to go. And we can do the best potions in raids. So uh, yeah, that's pretty exciting, honestly. And eh, fuck, too early. <laughs> and here we go, 90 Herblor is accomplished. And now we can do uh, basically the best... Um, the best, uh, well, we can do super combat potions, and on top of that, we can do the best overloads in raids, and I will be going for 100 raids for points, so that's definitely pretty nice. I'll still finish off all the potions that I have in my bank. <laughs> Fuck, man. Um, and, uh, yeah, I don't think I can get to another level, though. 
Here we go, we are making our first super combat potions and we're gonna be using those in raids, so that's gonna be really cool. That's how you do it, you take 7 out and you just make a bunch. So I'll have 34, which is pretty much enough for 34 raids. Eventually I wanna get, I, was, I would assume, around 100 of these, uh, but I don't have any Torstal Seeds at the moment, so that's literally all I have, but it's pretty good. We are gonna go and alk all of our uh, loot and if we look at the bank, we should have a lot of rune items, so... If I go right here and type rune... Uh, oh, that's money, man. So we're basically gonna be doing uh, medium clue scrolls and alking all of these at the same time. I'll also be alking all of the uniques, but I'll leave one of each. So for example, this Bandos Full Helms, I'll take two of those out, alk them and stuff like that. It's gonna be a long process, but we should be getting a lot of money out of it. Wait, is this a task? I swear it is. Ooh, it is. There it is. How many? 50 more leak points, nice. There you go, 88 magic from just alking all the drops that I get from clue scrolls. We're up to 8.4 million cash. Here we go, one more alk. There it is, green cash stack on the account. How beautiful does that look? We still have 15 clues to go through. And uh, yeah, we're just gonna do those very fast. And then we are gonna open all of these, get all the boots, and the day is gonna be great. Alright, we are done alking everything for 10 million and we are also done uh, finishing 50 um, mediums. So we're now gonna open everything to see what do we get. I'm pretty excited for these. I haven't seen any boots yet. We're just gonna bank all our gear. And uh, I think we're just gonna open five at a time and then instantly bank everything. We're gonna try to do this as fast as possible. We are hoping for boots and master clue scrolls pretty much. So yeah, let's just get into it. Let's see what do we get. Boom. Alright, here we go. First five. Nope. Okay, decent, nope, nope, oh what the fuck, pink elegant blouse, nothing there. Okay, we can do 10 I think. A lot of like uniques though, strength MET? Nope, nope, I think I'll just bank him like, ah oh, fuck, I should have I should have done 5 at a time, I know it. Here we go, we're gonna do 2 at a time, I mean 5 at a time. So there was what, a Zami page there. 1, 2, master clue first, 3, 4, 5, okay. Wait, is someone gonna keep track of master clues? That was one master clue so far. Still no sign of any boots. Quite a lot of uniques though, but no sign of boots at all. Oh, this one didn't even pop up on the screen. Nothing there. That would be awkward. If those were ranger boots and they didn't pop up on the screen, I'd be a bit sad. Uh, but yeah, 25 done and still no sign of boots. I think it's fair to say that we're pretty unlucky. There we go, the master clue stroll number two. And we still have 20 to go through. I swear if I don't get boots, I'll be pretty sad. Come on. I just want boots. Okay, that one's pretty decent. Another cloak. Quite a lot of uniques, but once again, no boots. Ooh, that one's kind of nice. Um, Hosidius Banner. Ha! <laughs> Interesting. Alright, four more. Come on. Nice, another master. At least that's good. We're gonna do a specific video where we're gonna be completing a lot of master clues. Um, you know, that I uh, have in the bank right now. But we have 10 left. Can I please get the boots? Any boots, even if it's uh, climbing boots. I just want to see. I guess uh, we're pretty unlucky today. Oh, wait, what did I... God damn it, I misclicked. It's okay, five more. Four, three, two, one. Fuck. Okay, I guess, uh, I guess today was just not the day, man. What is this? Ah. Oh. Anyways, as we usually do, if this was the main game, we would have gotten uh, 1.85 million from uh, this. Oh, it didn't count one, so probably close to 2 mil, I'd say. Maybe 1.9 mil out of all of these, so not the best, but uh, we still have about 350 medium clue scrolls to do. But anyways, we're gonna be doing more clue scrolls, uh, I guess, soon. This video was brought to you once again by the supporters. Thank you very much, guys, for supporting the channel. You can see yourselves on the screen right now. You guys are making this all possible, and I'm very grateful to have you. So thank you very much, and I'll see you all again tomorrow at about 7 p.m. GMT once again with another video. Have a beautiful day, everyone, and bye-bye.